Welcome to part 6 of automatic controllers. Here we have control by fluid expansion and fluid expansion is a way to sense temperature change and a thermometer is described as a column of temperature sensitive fluid rising and falling within a bellow stem in response to the sense temperature or the level of heat intensity and the level of liquid in the hollow stem is determined by the temperature of the liquid which is in the thermometer's bulb and you have the diaphragm which is thin, flexible and a movable membrane which is brass, steel or metal and it is used to convert pressure changes to movement and this movement can stop, start or modulate controls. And here we have the bulb which is near the flame and it's filled with mercury and the heating bulb causes the mercury to expand which moves up the transmission tube and f it flexes out the diaphragm and that means it has a pilot flame which is present to ignite the main burner which is right here. And here we have a large bulb which is partially filled with a volatile liquid and one that boils and creates vapor pressure when it's heated and this causes an increase in vapor pressure and the diaphragm has to move outward and then it is cooled and the vapor condenses and the diaphragm moves inward. And here we have A and B. A is A and B are remote bulbs which transmits the which A and B is a remote bulb which transmits pressure to the diaphragm which is based on the temperature in the cooler. And I'll see you with part two of this.